in Chinese culture represent persistence, resistance, and independence. Pink, her favorite color, provides feelings of caring, self-worth, tenderness, love, and acceptance, calmness, and relaxation. Most importantly, Chen Ying sees pink as a universal love she's blessed with through family, friends, and God. Thank you, contestant number four, Chen Ying Wu. Contestant number five, Zhou Suan Kong. Zhou Suan, also known as Laura, was born in Taichung, Taiwan, and is a daughter of Xu Shen Tseng. She is a graduate of Kaifuki High School and is attending Kapiolani Community College, where she is working on her liberal arts courses. 
Laura was freshman and sophomore class president at Kaimuki High School and an honors graduate. She's planning to go to cosmetology school in January. After graduation, she plans to work in a related field to gain experience and open up a business for brides who want to get their nails, hair, and makeup done. For Laura's chong song, she chose the color pink because of its simplicity. As a child, she loved the color pink and what it meant to her. It meant to her a way of showing her individuality. The color pink was girly and her way of showing her personality through color, so it's only natural that the pink came with shiny beads and eye-catching lines that run throughout the dress, showing the many lines of roots that has made her who she is today. Thank you, contestant number five, Joe Swan Hong. <laughs> contestant number six, Erica Kwai Hing Lee. <laughs> Erica was born in Honolulu and is a proud daughter of Wayson and Edwina Lee. She is a graduate of Marino High School and graduated college in 2009 from Pacific University in Oregon with a Bachelor's of Science in Biology. As a young woman, Erica received the high school honors and placed third in the Pacific Coast Championships for sailing. She is an active member of the Hawaii Foundation for Chinese Culture and Arts and dances the Phoenix Dance Chamber. Erica is employed at Sterling and Tucker as the Client Services and Marketing Coordinator. Now in the Chinese culture, the lotus flower is a symbol of purity and beauty. And the golden phoenix represents strength and auspiciousness. Erica's elegant white chong song honors the beautiful lotus flower and mystical golden phoenix to portray her growth and love in life. The blue waters that cascade down the sides of her gown give light to small lotus buds and reflect her love for the islands and the natural beauty of Hawaii. Small lotus buds begin to emerge from the water and struggle to grow. This reminds her of the difficulties and obstacles in life and that there is always room for growth. Thank you, contestant number six, Erica Kwai Ying Lee. Contestant number seven, Sonia Mui Gi Yu Lei. Sonia was born in Honolulu and is the daughter of Nathan Ling and Christy Hong. She graduated from Roosevelt High School with honors and spent a year in Washington, D.C. at American University. During this year, she has been on the Dean's List and has joined the National Society of Collegiate Scholars and the Alpha Delta Honor Society. Sonia has made Dean's List in the College of Engineering at the University of Hawaii and has obtained a co-operative education position as a student engineer at the Pearl Harbor Naval Shipyard. Now the beauty is in its simplicity. These are words Sonia lives by. Sonia's gown is white, like an artist's canvas. It provides a background to show contrast between colors and shapes. The dress has hints of sparkles, much like glistening snowflakes as they fall. Bunches of sea green flowers flow down the gown like a path being drawn by nature. Behind these flowers emerge roses, each one signifying a momentous occasion in her life. Her first violin lesson, graduating from high school, and starting college. The color combination of pink and sea green has been one of her favorites because it reminds her of spring and the year she spent in Washington, D.C. Thank you, contestant number seven, Sonia Mui Gyu Lei. Anime Oi Su Hu. daughter of Randy and Peggy Su Hu. She's a second generation Chinese American and just recently graduated from the University of Hawaii at Manoa, where she is a religion major with a focus on peace studies. In addition to her academic studies, she works in sales at Abercrombie and Fitch and is active in community services. Her community service activities focus on promoting the media and arts, preservation of a fragile environment, raising awareness of women issues through education, entertainment, and positive re representation of women. Christina's Chow Song is a reminder of love. 
from the color of her dress to the elegant butterfly carefully hand-stitched to her dress by her sisters and herself. She is reminded that she is a collaboration of a culture, family, friends, and love, just like her chong song, which is inspired by her mother's wedding dress. The red in her dress represents the vibrancy and love for her family and friends, which flickers with warmth and radiates with a sea of gold sequins. Each bead shimmers and flashes with intensity and pride like the rays of the sun, and just like the people in her life, every detail, meticulously hand-sewn, represents her beloved community working together for a higher purpose. Thank you, contestant number eight, Christina and May Oi Su Wu. Contestant number nine, Yan Yu So. Yan was born in Guangdong, China, and is the daughter of Kam Hong So and Sal Lin Yip. She's a graduate of Ho Mantin Government Secondary School and is attending Hawaii Pacific University, where she is majoring in international business. Yan is employed at SCORE as a Hawaii export assistant. She speaks Mandarin and Cantonese, and her interests include traveling, painting, cooking, dancing, meeting new people, and learning new things. Embellished with eight little golden narcissus flowers, Yan's ivory white chong song embodies a messenger of goodness, purity, and virginity. The Chinese recognize the narcissus as a necessity during the Chinese New Year for symbolizing good luck, wealth, and happiness. As part of the Chinese culture, the influence of family and friends is perhaps the most important factor in life. Thank you, contestant number nine, Yan Yu So. Contestant number 10, Ning Jing Liao. <laughs> Ning Jing was born in Nanjing, Jiangsu Province, and is the daughter of Xiaoping Liao. She's a graduate of the Fa Asao Marist High School in American Samoa and is attending the University of Hawaii at Manoa, where she is pursuing her master's degree in accounting. Ning Jin is a recipient of a variety of scholarships, including the Graduate Division Achievement, American Society of Women Accountants. Ning Jin is the president of the Chinese Students and Scholars Association at UH Manoa and an executive board member of the Hawaii Mainland Chinese Overseas Association. In the cloudless morning sky, the sun rises to shine its bright warmth on the small cottage garden filled with glistening peony flowers. The dew on each flower radiates like a bed of sparkling jewels as the playful butterflies bask lively and cheerfully in the fresh morning air. Now this picturesque scenery represents the theme of Ning Jin's Chiang Song. With their lushness and fullness, the peonies become vibrant, alive, and embody romance and prosperity, and are also regarded as an omen of good fortune. Cultural myth has honored the butterfly as a symbol of transformation because of its impressive ability of metamorphosis. Thank you, contestant number 10, Ning Jin Yao. Contestant number 11, Alexander Chen. <laughs> Alexander was born in Lillington, Delaware, and is the daughter of Lian Tai Chen and Chi Yu Chang. She is a graduate of McKinley High School, where she was a member of the McKinley Chinese Club, Klein High School Band, Girl Scouts, and Klein High School Asian American Club. She now attends the Paul Brown Institute at Remington College, where she is majoring in cosmetology. Alexandra was employed at Panya Bistro and Bakery as a cashier and speaks Mandarin and Taiwanese. In Chinese history, the phoenix is an ancient, mythical, multicolored bird that became legendary extinction. The auspicious bird endowed goodness and fortune to people, which is why Alexandra embroidered a phoenix at the chest, portraying her sincerity and integrity. Alexandra came from Taiwan and was immersed with Chinese culture. She is now assimilating into the American culture and seeing the beauty of the Western phoenix. Alexandra has prepared to blend the wonderful Eastern and Western cultures into the depth of her soul and emanates her love and care to a society as depicted by the blend of pink, gold, and silver colors in the Phoenix. Thank you, contestant number 11, Alexandra Chen.
Contestant number 12, Stacy Mason Baba. <laughs> Stacy was born in Honolulu and is a daughter of Lloyd and Maxine Baba. She's a graduate of Pearl City High School and is attending the William S. Richardson School of Law at UH Manoa. Stacy is employed at the University of Hawaii as a program coordinator. She received a master's degree in educational administration and the Fish Scholarship for Excellence from the Scheidner College of Business as an undergraduate business student, which gave her the opportunity to study abroad in Florence, Italy. She belongs to advocates for public interest law, law and business organization, and the Academic Grievance Committee. A Stacy's Chong Song is a reflection of her love for the Chinese culture, the blessings in her life, and the optimism she embodies. The gold in Stacy's Chong Song symbolizes the wealth and happiness in her life. She believes that wealth is not measured by finances, but by the love and support from family and friends. The leaves trickling down indicate a new season and chapter in Stacy's life. She is so grateful to have the opportunity to pursue a law degree and to have developed friendships with all these amazing women in the Narcissus pageant. And with the year of the rabbit upon us in 2011, Stacy adorned this chomp sum with red jewels, personifying auspiciousness and the prosperity that she hopes will bring to her new year as well as yours. Thank you, contestant number 12, Stacy Mason Baba. Contestant number 13, Kimberly Wing Son Leong. Kimberly was born in Honolulu and is the daughter of Margaret Wong Ming Leong and the late Elvin Yu Tong Leong. She is a graduate of Marino High School and recently graduated from Hawaii Pacific University with a Bachelor's of Science in Nursing. Kimberly is employed at Kahu Malama Nurses as a nurse's aide and Abercrombie and Fitch as a part-time impact stock team member. She speaks Cantonese and her interests include, most importantly, spending time with family and friends and finding new and interesting restaurants to enjoy. And one of Kimberly's favorite quotes from the movie The Lion King was, Suma, let me tell you something. My father told me, look at the stars. The great kings of the past are up there watching over us. So like that quote, Kimberly's Chong Sung represents the culmination of the love and support of family and friends, hard work, and the dedication that she has made to do her best. Her shining stars of silver against a dark blue represents her dad, whom she lost in April 2010. The gold swirls, like Van Gogh's starry night painting, represents her mom, who has encouraged her every step of the way. The swirls emphasizes many endeavors, highlights, and obstacles that she's encountered over the years. Thank you, contestant number 13, Kimberly Wayne Hassan Leong. Thank you so much ladies, you look stunning tonight.